Hi everyone! Welcome to Patty Pocket Pouring Art. Today I'm going to be doing a flip cup, which I haven't done forever it seems. Um, I'm using all these colors. A few of them are leftovers, but I'm going to be doing it on a 10 by 10 canvas and let me go through the colors real quick. Or you know what? I'll go through the colors when I put them in the cup. Um, today my background is semi-gloss. Um, it's a glitten semi-gloss house paint and it's half paint, half Floetrol, a little bit of GAC 800 and a little bit of um, gloss medium, which means um, it's this, a little bit of this varnish in there. So I'm going to try that as my background. Um, all my colors are mixed with Floetrol and water only. I did, I haven't used silicone forever either, so today I'm using silicone, um, one drop in both the blues and the pink. Um, so we'll see what happens. Oh, and the um, cell activator, with the, this black is a cell activator I use on my um, Shelly Art Technique, and it's half American Floetrol, half Australian Floetrol, this, and I mixed it three to one um, with, what did I mix it with? Three to one. Oh, with that three to one, this is a Amsterdam Black Oxide. So three parts Floetrol, the 50-50 combo, one part um, Amsterdam Black Oxide, and it's a little bit thinner than the others, but all my paints leave a mound for about a uh, second, maybe two seconds. But um, for a flip cup, you need your paints a little bit thicker. So let's see what happens. Um, I'll be right back. Okay, I have my white base down. Now I'm gonna be filling up my cup here. Move this over a little bit. All right, so I don't know, this is probably five ounces. I don't know how much. This is only a 10 by 10, so I don't need a whole lot. Start with the white. Now this white is a mixture between golden, iridescent pearl fine, and creative inspirations pearl. 50-50 on those. This next color is DecoArt Extreme Sheen Aquamarine. Some of these I'm only going to do one layer of because I didn't put that much in there. Now this one does have silicone in it. Okay, the next color is, and this is my first time trying this, this is the um, Alchemy Opal Magic. These are expensive and, and they're pretty thin. This is called Coral Teal. It's like a shift paint. We can't see that. So um, they're not very big. They're only one, 1 1.7 ounces. You can get them in, I think I got them in a three, three or four pack on Amazon. If you look down in the description, uh, most of my materials, including this, you can click on. And um, I'm an affiliate for Amazon. And then you can just purchase what you'd like. Helps me out. Okay, this is, this is that color, the pink. This does have silicone in it also. It's just, I didn't want to use the whole container because I just wanted to test it out first before I use it all. Okay, this is the cell activator. Just pour that just right over the top. I know how black takes over, but I haven't used a cell activator in a flip cup. So we'll see what happens. This is that. This is another color of the. Let me show you what this color is. It's Opal Magic, and the color is teal pink. Same brand as the other one. I did mix. So if you use that and you need your paints thicker, I just want to show you what I use. So I thought this paint was a little bit too thick, or too thin for me, for a flip cup. So what I did is I mix 
a little bit of the golden gel medium. This uh, you can use glue also, but glue just isn't quite thick enough um, sometimes. So this is you have to stir it really well. But this is a golden medium, and it's really thick. But it's it's good to have around um, if you need your paints a little thicker. Okay, this is 24 karat. And I mixed 24 karat with the Folk Art 14 karat. That one and that one, 50% each with the Floetrol. And I got that really pretty color. This um, is a leftover paint. And this is the Deco Art, uh, what is it? Deco Art Pewter. The satin deco art pewter and I mixed that with some creative inspirations phalo blue so I have that already mixed up because I think it's a beautiful color so I know you guys can't see that I'm just throwing it in there at this point looks like a messy cup but I'm gonna do some more white on the top of the blue because you can never have enough white. That's how I feel about it. Whenever you think you have enough white, eh, give it some more. But I don't recommend putting your black and your white together in a cup. You're just asking for it to make gray. That's the case. So let me see. I guess I'll put a little bit the rest of this gold in here. Why not? Okay, just sprinkle it in there. It's been so long since I've done a flip cup. Oh my gosh. And do I want to put some more cell activator? Maybe a little bit on the top. Okay, because that's going on the bottom. All right, let's see what happens. know that what the cell activator is actually doing for this one I don't see any kind of you know there is black around a lot of the cells but other than that I don't know that pearl white just completely disappeared the pink is Pretty much gone I could see it underneath here so what I'll do is I'm gonna wait about 10 minutes um, the gold is I don't like what, how that looks actually so let me try to tilt some of that off So let me bring you back. I'm going to wait about 10 minutes, see if anything happens, and I shall return. Okay, guys. I don't like it. It's a complete fail. Remember when I said you need more white than you think you do? Well, I didn't listen to my own suggestion on that one. Um, so I have a bunch of leftover colors, mostly in the red, orange tones. I'm going to go ahead and tilt this, get as much paint off as I can, and do another flip cup, and we'll see what else we get. Be right back. Okay, so I have some leftover colors here. There's only a few colors that I know what they are. The others are mixed. Um, so the ones I know what they are, um, this one right here, 
really pretty. This is a deco art. What is this? Granat? Oh, garnet. Sorry. <laughs> I was reading the French version. Version. That's garnet. This is a mixture. This is my cell activator from this painting. I do you know this is a artist loft red ochre? Sort of a more of an orange. This is one of my mixtures, and I'm using some more of the 5050 pearl white with um, the golden pearl white. No opal magic in this cup. Just trying to get rid of these. I'm just going to do a flip cup over this. So let's get started here. I did add silicone. There are silicone in this color and silicone in this orange color I'm putting in right now. It's the only colors that have silicone. I'm writing down all my tips and tricks and at some point I'm going to do a video, especially for the beginner fluid artists. Um, I've been doing this probably since I think June of 2017 and I've had this channel for over a year now. So as you go you learn some things, some shortcuts, some tips, um, some tricks, some ways to to make things cheaper, materials, ways to make things easier. So I'm trying to write those down. And when I get a big enough list that I can remember, then, because every time I remember something, I'm like, oh yeah, that goes on the list. So I put it down. And at some point, I'm going to put a video together with all those. So stay tuned. Push the subscribe button, notification bell, that way you don't miss any videos I do. And be so kind as to shop down below on Amazon for the first hour and a half. You can buy whatever you want. You don't have to buy the materials that I have the links to, but once you get in there, shop for your normal stuff. And I get a very, very small percentage at no cost to you, no extra cost to you. So why not? Why not do it like that? All right, here we go. I have been in an orange mood lately. I'm sure, that's plenty of paint. So, well, the white showed up. Lightly torch it. Quite a contrast there. I could wreck it. Helps get rid of some bubbles. If you do that, that's a little tip. Okay, got a lot of pearl over here. Sort of everything's more separated, which is fine with me. It's like a straight line there. All right, which way do I want to go first? I'm just going to sort of roll it around. much better. I guess it really depends on what happens with the what's underneath. I like it right now. I 
All right, I definitely like this better. So I'm gonna give this about 10 minutes. Looks like that blue and the bottom layer is coming through. I'm not sure how much of it's gonna come through. Thank you.